Hi Libra, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well today. This is gonna be for anybody with Libra placements in their charts. Okay guys, let's hop in, let's see what's going on with my Librans. Alrighty, thank y'all so much for your love, your support, your um, donations, and your super chats, your super thanks. Sending you guys um, that love right on back, okay? So let's hop in Libra, let's see what's going on here. Okay. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses, please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Libra and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones return it back to the sender, block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Librans. And protect me as I channel the messages for Libra. Witch, high priestess, and marriage counseling. Hmm. <laughs> marriage counseling wants to come out. Okay. Tarot reader. Temperamental. Somebody could be mad at a tarot reader. You came out in Taurus reading in the beginning. Or tarot reader is mad about some shit. I don't know. So we have child we have childhood fears. Someone is traumatized by their childhood. Injustice and toxic in the reverse. <clears throat> Fake profiles on social media. Feeling conflicted and confused. So for some of you guys, you're seen online doing something, Libra. There's something that you're doing online here. And this person is feeling conflicted and confused about something here. Okay, whatever they're seeing is not what they want to see when it comes down to whatever you're doing online. Okay. Somebody here could want you to like spiral out of control with your fears and your worries and things like that. Like they want you to be sickly, like sickly. I feel like they, they just want you to be, yeah, they want you to operate out of your lower self, lower self here, deep rooted insecurities. A cry for help. This is what somebody wants you to feel like. This is what somebody wants you to feel like. I feel like... Y'all know how I feel. <laughs> okay, I ain't even, I'm not in the mood to be cursing these people out. So, there could be something going on with your inner child here, Libra, possibly. Maybe your childhood fears are activated. Um, and if that's the case, I feel like there's a need to just do just do some sort of shadow work here and just try to keep your energy grounded, stable. Okay, somebody because somebody's like looking for something on you to see if you're struggling or to see if you're traumatized still or you're messed up about some shit. So that way they can keep on what trying to attack you and stop stop you from doing something. They're trying to catch you when your vibe is low. So it's important that you stay high vibe at all times. Okay, like even if you are going through something. I feel like you're confusing the enemy when you do shit like that. Because they, they confused. So you could already be doing it. Yeah, the stupid ass King of Swords reverse. Ace of Swords reverse. The Emperor reverse. I feel like this bitch right here. They trying to prove a point to other motherfuckers. And the point would never be proven. Whoever this is right here. They're getting on my nerves. Because they, they've been coming out all day. Could be a baby daddy. Or uh, could be any damn body. Your father, an ex, or whoever. They raggedy, but what's childhood fears? The world here in the Six of Swords reverse. Somebody here could be traveling with the Six of Swords reverse in the world. You could be returning somewhere. Okay, or something is coming back up <clears throat> that you're needing to, yeah, the devil, that you're needing to work through here. Maybe it's a lesson that needs to be learned that hasn't quite been learned. This could be like some sort of trouble headed your way online or there could be some sort of like uh, something going on with the world. This Six of Souls in reverse could be a disaster, a natural disaster. So, you know, out, out here in Texas, if you're in Texas, you know about the hurricane. So 
this could be traumatizing you or causing you to feel fear or scared. You could do something online, but you see, I'm doing what I'm whatever I need to do online. Nothing is stopping me. This person, I feel like this person wants you to stop work or they want you to do something. They want you to stop doing whatever the fuck you're doing. Yeah, pay the pentacles reverse. For some of you, somebody here is doing magic or they're doing a lot of divination spying. But they want you to like stop doing what you're doing or be scared or whatever. I feel like this person don't know how smart you are. So what's the six of souls in the reverse? But this could be, um, yeah, the high priestess in the reverse. What's six of souls reverse, high priestess reverse? Something could be slowly progressing or this is a slow progression with, with uh, something that you're doing as far as your healing journey. But I feel like with the world, this is a new cycle. A new beginning is starting for you. This is you feeling whole and complete. You're calm. You're happy. Like, So there's some sort of unwanted attention that somebody is getting. I feel like their childhood fears are being um, brung up because this person could be getting some sort of unwanted attention or there's trouble headed they, they way because I feel like you ain't worried. I feel like you ain't worried at all. The high priestess in reverse is like outburst here. What's six of swords reverse with the high priestess reverse? Or oh, they trying to run away from their consequences? Yeah, the nine of swords. So somebody could be feeling trapped or stuck somewhere and they nervous about it. What's the nine of swords? The sun reverse. Yeah, somebody's like oppressed or they're they're miserable. They had high hopes for something and they was let down or they've been let down here. <clears throat> Somebody could have went to a dark high priestess that specializes in like natural disasters and stuff. Or not natural disasters, but like um changing the weather. Somebody has the ability to fuck with the weather. Okay, and that's definitely a gift that somebody could have, but they abuse it clearly because they want... <laughs> somebody wants you to shut up the the eight of swords here somebody wants you to be silenced just period but i'm definitely getting this king of wands is in competition with you and i feel like this person was always silenced a lot of their life so they want you to feel the same way they're just projecting just period page of cups in reverse somebody's very promiscuous this person does have a lot of inner child healing that they need to be doing this person could have been abused as a child so that could be their issue and they just they just haven't healed from it since, child. So, the sun. This could be a distorted masculine. What's the nine of swords here with the sun reverse? Somebody here also, they can't see something. I feel like fear is in the way of their judgment. Like, they, they can't see anything. This person's intuition could be blocked. What's the nine of swords with the sun reverse? Yeah, the two of pentacles. So, yeah, it's, it's like, you know, two of pentacles is like being open, flexible, adapting. So I feel like you're adapting to something. You're adapting to these changes. You're adapting very well to something. Like, I, I don't know if somebody's like trying to test your strength. It's like, bitch, you're nobody to be trying to test. Because when the test fall back on your ass... When it's time for you to be tested, I, you're going to be the first one to fold. So I feel like this person got you fucked up. <laughs> like, real shit. They definitely do. They most definitely got you fucked up. And then they're going to have, they hope like, oh my God, something happened over there. I hope that, you know, they, they just fall off the face of the earth or stop talking. Bitch, no. <laughs> no. So for some of you, I mean, this could be you too feeling you don't feel too enthused about these changes, but you're adapting very well. You could be juggling or you have a lot on your plate, but I just feel like that's somebody energy mixed in with yours because they're the ones that can't adapt to these changes and you can. Yeah, like I feel like you're cool. I don't know what somebody else's problems is. Okay, period. But yeah, judgment. What's the world? Like the show don't stop for you. What's the world? The Ace of Cups, period. Being celebrated, being happy. This is a lot of abundance, prosperity. A new beginning in love. Here you could be meeting new people. You're celebrating. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Shit, hurricane and all. Or, you know, uh, whatever is going on in your life. I feel like you're keeping a positive attitude. You're staying positive. You're vibing. Just period. There could be something new you're getting ready to start. Or, um, 
this could be you where you've reached a higher level of consciousness here, but you're getting a good offer. And I feel like you're going to embrace it. So what, let me see. What's the world with the Ace of Cups? Some of you guys could be welcoming a baby into the world. This is a new project. Something that's emotionally fulfilling. Six of Wands reverse. So yeah, somebody here lost. This could be a whole group of people. Smear campaign or people that have ill intentions that don't, that act like they don't see you, but bitch, you, you're very much so seen. <laughs> like they, they're, they're hating. They're jealous. A, a group of people with ill intentions or a group of clout chasing assholes. They want to take your spot so bad, Libra. I feel like they're not getting a fucking sh nothing from your energy. So, okay, bitch. What's injustice in the reverse and toxic? The moon. What's injustice in the reverse and toxic here? And the king of pentacles reverse. Cancer Pisces towards Virgo Capricorn. So somebody is being deceptive or they're hiding the fact that they sitting up here broke and raggedy. They're a bum. Just king of pentacles in the reverse. This person... Could also be hiding the fact that they're a cheater, they're a liar. They're very greedy, very superficial, materialistic. They want some sort of status so bad. Okay. This person is hiding a lot. I feel like they're scared that they're going broke or they're scared that they're going to lose some sort of rank or status. Or something getting ready to come out about their ass being homosexual or being obsessed about you and just being a loser. So I feel like this person getting ready to be scared because they getting ready to lose some money though. There's something going on with their stability, their security, and they're hoping to God. And then, you know, it's crazy because it's like, well, bitch, your life is fucked up. You don't have anything. Just like I told Taurus, you don't have anything, but yet you're wishing bad on other people because you're so hateful. And then you sit up here and really be mad when you out here homeless or something do you remember when you hated on that person and basically cursed their life spoke negative over their life now you don't have anything i feel like that's what the fuck you get <laughs> like i mean that shit wholeheartedly like what the fuck are you saying what's the king of pentacles reverse the king of cups reverse yeah somebody here they do too much they do way too much very emotionally manipulative and mean this is a mean person very mean and then they wonder why they don't have shit they don't have compassion empathy or sympathy for nobody else they don't give a fuck could be a scorpio they got a scorpio in their raggedy ass chart somewhere this person's gifts is blocked too this person could also do magic can of cups in reverse is somebody that do magic or they getting somebody else to do it what's the king of pentacles reverse king of cups and they think that this shit gonna stop your shine no What's King of Pentacles reverse? King of Cups reverse. This person could be cheating with a man. It's like, bitch, you got bigger fucking fish to fry, it looks like to me. Yeah, look, the lovers. Sexuality. This person don't know what they want. They don't know what they want or they have some sort of major decisions to make or whatever. But this person here, they on some other shit and they hiding it. That's why they want you to stop doing what you're doing or they want you to like, I don't know, but you're not. You're not. So I feel like with injustice and toxic in reverse, you didn't do shit. You ain't, you wasn't doing anything unjust or toxic. It's them. And then they're, they're hiding it. I feel like if this person is into the same sex, this is what aligns with them. This is where they're happy at, but they're hiding it from the world. For some of you, this person is distraught about you getting a union. Yeah, with the four of wands, you're meeting people that align with where you're at in your journey. This is union, partnership, duality, yin and yang, period. What's the lovers? Yeah, the five of pentacles. What's the lovers five of pentacles? So somebody feels abandoned or left out in the cold or because... You are doing something that aligns with you. You're in alignment. This person, whatever they've tried to do to interfere with your energy in some sort of way, it's not working. Like this person wants you to get out of alignment really bad and you're not. What's the lover's five of pentacles? For some of you guys, you're making a decision about your career path and what you want to do. The 
page of swords reverse. Yeah, so somebody's getting some sort of bad news or a plan is not working. I feel like there's a lot of malicious gossip as well. Or they're being talked about maliciously. Or they will be. Because they should have left you alone. People don't want their business to come out. Especially in my readings, bitch. Because I'm going to call you out. People don't want their business to come out. I feel like they need to stay up off my shit. <laughs> That's how I feel, bitch. If you don't want to be read, then don't fucking come over here trying to get it all up in... You know what I'm saying? Trying to ruin some shit I got going on. Because, bitch, you're going to get aired the fuck out. And it's not going to be cute or pretty and it's not going to feel good. And if you get mad, bitch, just know you can turn up if you want to. <clears throat> I feel like, you know, turn up if you want to. Turn up if you feel like it. You're going to get fucked up. I'm not one of them. I'm not nothing to be played with, period. I feel like people should know that by now. So, somebody getting bad news about their finances. Something is not looking good or whatever. Somebody feels really abandoned by you. Page of Swords reverse, Five of Pentacles. There's something going on with this person's sexuality too. I feel like this person has a lot of problems with uh, women. This is a man. They have a lot of problems with a lot of women. Because they probably got mommy issues and some more shit. But this is someone you don't even speak to. They feel really left out by you. And they're hiding it. So they're sending you the evil eye. Yeah, they're sending you nasty energy. Page of Souls Reverse, Five of Pentacles to throw you off your balance. To fuck up your money. Fuck up your finances. <laughs> like, dead ass. And you ain't did shit. You're getting good karma. Justice here. Upright. Like, what's the moon? Somebody here's really scatterbrained too. They're they just a liar as well. Like... Someone here is not speaking up about something that happened to them because they feel like they're going to be judged for it or they're going to be looked at in negative light or whatever. But this is going to bring them back into this is going to help they stupid ass out, <laughs> but they just want to continue to be to cause toxicity somewhere else with you or whatever, because they don't want to own their truth. Yeah, the Nine of Pentacles reverse. So codependency. Somebody's very codependent or somebody's hiding the fact too that they got scammed. Yeah, Queen of Swords reverse. Let me see. What's the moment with the Nine of Pentacles reverse? Mm. Yeah, so, so I, you know, this person could be hiding the fact that they got scammed here. And that's what fucked their finances up. And they don't want that truth to come out about the fact that they just set up here and got scammed or they didn't did some shit that they wasn't supposed to be doing. I feel like whatever partnership here that they were in with this nine of pentacles in the reverse possibly is over with. Somebody's options are now restricted. This person could deal with a lot of hoes, like prostitutes or they could have an addiction. Something wrong with them. But there was some sort of cooperation here with the Nine of Pentacles reverse, and that shit went left. That shit ain't work. What's the Nine of Pentacles reverse? Who this? Could be a Virgo, Virgo, Venus. Yeah, Three of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. Okay, Libra. So this could be somebody that you work with. For some of you, this is a supposed to be friend of yours, a fake asshole that probably works in the same field as you they use this person to scam you or set you up or try to anyway but instead they got set up and scammed because i feel like you remain focused like you're focused on your work here definitely strong virgo energy or that this is the person that they was working with on you or whatever this is who they sat up here and pillow talked to or gossiped about or whatever this is man Somebody here cheats a lot too. They they do something in excess, excessively. But I feel like now their options are restricted. With the two of wands reverse. This is like something that wasn't planned out very well either. <laughs> like, 
I feel like you're very skilled at something that you do. And somebody over here that they was dealing with is jealous. Like they're jealous. So they decided to what? Team up with this person against you or whatever this dumb ass shit is. What's the two of wands reverse? The devil. Exactly. <laughs> What's two of wands reverse with the devil? Uh, oh boy. Somebody fears the unknown. What's two of reverse with the devil? Seven of cups in the reverse. So yeah, some sort of get rich quick scheme that they did. And now they're restricted. Now they can't do it or whatever this is. For whatever reason, they can't do it. They're blocked. Just like they will always be. <laughs> like, this person is delusional. These people are really like, they're cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. <laughs> like they're, I don't understand why they even... Mm. so somebody's hiding this they're being deceptive that this is what they was involved in and now i feel like they did this shit to you behind the scenes but they have to keep it hidden because then they don't want you to look at them a certain way but i already feel like you know that they're a fucking loser and they did what they did so it's really nothing that they're hiding it's like they're crazy and slow as fuck they even sit up here and think that you don't know what they did and you're a high priestess Or you just intuitive, like you're smart. Like this person, they they lame as fuck. Maybe you could be playing nice with this hoe. I feel like that's really the funny part about it. Playing nice, you know, being cool. But the moment that they turn up on your ass, they gonna get their feelings hurt. I feel like that's why they, this person here, they do too much, man. <laughs> they really do. But then, and yet, and still, they need your help. They need your support. So that's like, what is that? They get some sort of benefit off off of you, but they don't. They yet and still they don't like you though. It's like bitch, pick a side, pick a fucking side. Then you get the lamest hoes, the lamest hoes to do some shit to you, a scamming ass bitch, that's deceptive towards your ass. Cause this bitch here, here is lying. They're a fake ass friend to you and and you Libra. Like they set their ass up, but they wasn't able to set you up. I feel like this person is stupid. Yeah, they they naive. They gullible. Six cups in reverse. Like they just. They just dumb. What the fuck is this fake profiles on social media? The chariot reverse. Cancer and the damn three of wands. Airy sun. So yeah, somebody here failed at something. There will be no victory or anything like that. Somebody here doesn't have a sense of direction. They lost. They don't know what the fuck to do. What's the cherry reverse? Ten of cups reverse. What's cherry reverse? Ten of cups reverse. Page of cups in the reverse, man. So yeah, so five of cups. Somebody is sad or whatever the fuck. They watching you on social media. See you moving forward, three of wands, or they sitting back waiting to see if something going on. But I feel like you feel self assured about moving forward. They're definitely trying to get some sort of insight on something. Somebody here getting some bad news. Whoever this is, they in a fake ass family dynamic they don't want to be in. And all they do is sit back and watch you all fucking day. <laughs> this person don't have the confidence or the willpower or the drive or to do anything in their life. But they definitely don't have the, the confidence to come and approach you. This person is non-confrontational, not a cups reverse. So I guess, okay, stay your pussy ass back where you at then. <laughs> like, we don't care if you never say shit. That's going to be on you. Okay? It don't matter. I feel like they embarrassed. They're trying to figure out, oh, well, which way? How can I approach Libra and say that I got set up by a bitch that I used to, to haunt and taunt Libra? I feel like, bitch, yeah, your best bet is to not say nothing to this to this Libra. Or if this is a, a Libra that's on some fuck shit, then cross watcher. It, it's their best bet not to say shit to you. <laughs> I feel like just stay on over there where the fuck you at. Because you definitely won't. You're not going to like what you hear, bitch. We forgive you. Move on. That's it. You don't need to, need to say anything. I feel like they're frustrated. They're mad because they can't say shit to you. But a lot of bad news. This person just comes from a dysfunctional family dynamic here. There's a lot of family secrets as well. Ten of cups reverse. Page of cups in reverse. 
they don't know how to navigate their 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 issues internally like this person they they were abused as a child or they just come from a very dysfunctional family dynamic this person could have been in and out of foster care um a lot of arguing and shit going on in the home this person was abandoned neglected like they don't know what the fuck very forceful very aggressive person mm. something happened to this person that they don't want to be shown or or they don't want people to know about that they haven't quite healed from but i feel like you know this person they just never gonna live in their truth and that's on them this is three of wands because right now i feel like there's no fucking excuse for you to act like a damn loser so everybody been hurt fucking most people been hurt as a child that's that's not a good excuse for you to go around hurting other people that shit ain't fucking cool yeah the high from reverse what's the three of wands with the high from reverse the temperance here and the three of pentacles reverse yeah somebody that don't want to learn from their past mistakes this person I just heard something about double standards. This person has double standards here. But I feel like, yeah, this is a false leader. This person here got negative patterns repeating time and time again. So I feel like you're being protected from them with the temperance. You're actually healed here to help this person heal, but they don't they don't want it. So I feel like, okay, they're like, well, if I don't have my family back or if I can't, da -da 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 -da, then I'm just going to keep causing chaos. And it's just like, okay, well, bitch, I guess you're going to keep doing that. You're going to keep getting fucked up. Mm -hmm. Eventually, you'll stop when you get fucked up too much. You'll stop. But somebody ain't got no drive, no work ethic, no goals, no ambition. <laughs> I feel like this person is watching you grow because I feel like you're very independent and you go your own way with the high from reverse. So you could be doing something that's causing a lot of controversy or, you know... This person has a different belief system than you. Y'all morals and values and integrity and shit is set up different. Like, you just don't got time for that. So somebody's watching you grow and change over time and watch you be independent. Some of y'all could have moved, you're traveling or something like that. Some sort of group here too, it broke up. This could be a, a cult or some sort of coven or secret society that you're being protected from. Or you're just an earth angel. You're an earth angel, so you're naturally going to be protected. I'm also getting... The cherry reverse two is out of control. These could be people in this person's family that they, that's dark like they ass. So I'm not surprised. This could be, um, this person is some sort of like a uh, alpha draconian or you could be a star seed here, Libra. This person is like, money hungry and manipulative this is a fallen soulmate like a fallen twin for some of you they definitely fell from grace this person they just all over the place and i feel like you're you're good off them yeah page of pentacles reverse knight of cups i mean page of pentacles reverse knight of pentacles reverse four cups in the reverse yeah you're moving on from them this person they ain't got no work ethic they lazy they expect everything to be handed to them and they don't have any fucking common sense sitting up here doing this black ass magic page of pentacles reverse or spying or whatever this is they're lazy as fuck this person is very lazy it could be virgo oh well what's feeling conflicted and confused they got a lot of problems and I feel like they need to go fix that shit and leave you alone. <laughs> the eight of wands, just feeling conflicted and confused. So somebody's conflicted and confused about something that you're saying or this is somebody feeling conflicted about you actually moving forward in a positive direction. Yeah, ace of pentacles. They're confused as to what's going on with your money or why you're still getting new opportunities or whatever. Ace of wands, the death card, the ten of pentacles. Yeah, you're going through some sort of transformation, transition, change. Whatever this is, you're working on new projects, you're traveling, you're doing you. You're having a good-ass fucking time. Period. A ball. Life is great. 
no matter what the circumstances are, what's going on. Life is cool. So I feel like you have a new offer coming in, Libra. This is could be a new home, new car. Maybe you're paying for a trip. Yeah, look, the home. So confirmation. Or this could be a twin flame union that's forming. Some of y'all could be getting ready to get married. Or you're meeting your soul tribe. You're meeting a lot of new people. Okay? And you're getting... Um, there's new opportunities just falling in your lap here. But for some of you, whatever you're saying, you could be a, a journalist. Or you could be publishing a book. You could be an author, a writer. Okay, yeah, if you're writing something or something with with communication, I feel like that's going to bring you your coinage here, period. <laughs> What's the Eight of Wands? Queen of Swords in the reverse. The Hermit reverse. King of Swords reverse. <laughs> Child. Somebody here sent something nasty to your finances. But what was this Queen of Swords reverse Eight of Wands here? Oh, wow, now we have the Queen, King of Swords upright, okay. I love when the cards, when I see some bullshit and then they flip upright. Good. So I feel like whoever this King of Swords is right here, this could be somebody that's coming into your life. They are setting boundaries with a Queen of Swords in the reverse. They've raised their standards and got rid of this bitter asshole. This could be your person. And I feel like your karmic ex here, your fallen twin, or whoever the fuck this hoe is, they're sitting up here watching you from fake pages and shit with their problems. <laughs> yeah, the hermit. It could be a Virgo here, Leo. So, yeah, you have, for some of you, you have communication coming in from this King of Swords. And they setting boundaries with this damn Queen of Swords reverse. And they come, they confuse. It's like, well, why is this person setting boundaries? Yeah, because they're in love with you. They're in love with you. They want to move forward with you. Yeah, and something is moving forward to regardless of who don't like it. What's the Queen of Souls reverse? Yeah, Knight of Cups in the damn reverse. So this King of Souls right here revoked their offer from this Queen of Swords in the reverse. Knight of Cups, this King of Swords. It could be an Aquarius. Either Aquarius Capricorn Cusper or Aquarius Pisces Cusper. Yeah, Aquarius. So confirmation on the Aquarius or it could be Gemini, whatever. But what's the Queen of Souls reverse, Knight of Cups in the reverse? The Hermit reverse. Yeah, somebody could be coming out of Hermit mode. <clears throat> somebody is obsessive and they're a troublemaker, just period. They just are. Someone here with the Queen of Swords in reverse, Knight of Cups reverse, this person, this Queen of Swords is giving this King of Swords bad advice about something. Because I feel like whoever this is, they're pulling up things from your background or they're, they're getting knowledge on you in some sort of way to use against you to tell this King of Swords to not come towards you. But I feel like they're coming anyway because somebody ain't dumb or stupid or slow. This Queen of Swords is not too bright, bitch. They're not a bright bitch at all. Could be another Libra, a Gemini, or an Aquarius feminine. They're not too bright at all. Yeah, whoever this is, too. This Emperor Reverse, Knight of Swords Reverse, and the damn it, Five of Swords. This person got a mental health disorder. They're a bully. They're a criminal. This, this could be your baby daddy for some of you. Somebody that's a follower. Okay, like... So I feel like this person is using your past against you. They're trying to use your past against you. This queen of souls in reverse. And they're trying to make it seem like you or something. They're trying to make it seem like you was, did somebody bad in the past. When they did you bad, you were the one abused and set up and all kind of shit. I feel like by somebody here that's a troublemaker, somebody around you is still obsessed with you. And this queen of souls in the reverse, they know it. I feel like they get, for some of you, this person gets readings done on you. They get some sort of information from you some sort of way or they're getting it from social media. Maybe you're saying something on social media about it or whatever this is. I don't know, but okay. What's the King of Swords? They feel like they got so much tea on your life. It's like, bitch, mind your raggedy ass business because if somebody here pulled the skeletons out your raggedy, dirty ass closet, you're going to be looking fucked up. Yeah, somebody here tried to ruin your reputation. Somebody could have said that you was a hoe or you sleeping around with your ex or you're doing this and that. You're the troublemaker. You're the one that's obsessed and you're this, you're that. I feel like, bitch, your mammy. <laughs> your mama, bitch. Somebody's annoying. They're annoying. They're annoying. What's 
the king of swords with the nine of cups reverse four of cups reverse page of pentacles reverse yeah and the ten of swords reverse so this slander or gossip it didn't work Whatever this magic is or this whatever the shit is that somebody's doing, they're obsessively watching you. They could be, like I said, somebody's obsessively getting readings done on you. Or they're switching your readings around and saying, oh, well, you're lying or you're not telling the truth. But it's really them. They could be a reader, too, or something like that. But some sort of plan ain't working because you're still moving forward and somebody's not getting their wish. Nine of cups in the reverse or this masculine is coming towards you to regardless of what this bitch is saying. Now they sitting up, sit up here in their head or they feeling some kind of way. I feel like, bitch, that's what you get because you should have kept your damn. You should have kept your mouth shut, bro. <laughs> yeah, the death card. Like, you should have just kept your mouth shut and you should have just minded your damn business and let go when it's time for your ass to let go of somebody. So you've overcome some sort of slander, gossip, or whatever this magic was, this curse, this hex, or whatever. And you're not missing no more opportunities. Something is moving out of a stalemate. You're not in this energy or this your person. Somebody ain't in this energy of woe is me or acting like they don't know what the fuck going on. Somebody's being seen as a liar. What's the, ten, what's the Ace of Pentacles? The Empress, period. You're getting this offer, Empress. This is definitely you coming out. This could be you getting ready to birth something new as well. You have a new project that's going to lead you to a lot of abundance and money and whatever else. Just period. Somebody's shifting their perspective about you and they actually want to help you here. Or you have more help coming in or this is like more money. You could be giving back to your community and shit like that. Like you got real shit going on. Somebody's sitting up here lying with a raggedy slow ass because they, they, they damn baby daddy or somebody don't want to be with them. What's this Ace of Pentacles and the Empress? Yeah, nobody want to be with you because you're a bitter hoe. What's the Ace of Pentacles with the Empress? Two of Cups, period. Two of fucking Cups, and you're manifesting it. And this Emperor in the reverse, Queen of Wands reverse, all these bitches, it don't even matter really what's going on with them. Sorry about the lighting, guys. It looks like it's getting darker or it's getting ready to rain, child. But I don't know. I'm not staying on these readings too long today, Libra, because I don't feel like reading this nasty-ass energy. I'm not in the mood today. <laughs> like, they, didn't, they they really be pissing me off. And I don't, you know what I'm saying? No. So you have a new offer coming in, a new, a new partnership or somebody that you're in love with. You and this person could be friends, but definitely there's some romantic feelings here. Somebody's feeling confused or conflicted because they're like, well, why are they not listening to me? Why are they not listening to my advice? Or why is the magic not working? Bitch, because it's getting ready to fucking reverse. That's why. So hopefully you prepare for that while you're sitting up here waiting for somebody else's downfall. Somebody don't have, sh they don't want to hear shit that your ass gotta say because you're a liar and a manipulator. What else? Give me a card here for legal or a few of them. So we have attachments. I release all attachments. Change me, divine beloved, into one who trusts that the perfect relationship always arrives on time. Let me feel worthy and deserving of love, period. Yeah. Something is moving really slow for you, Libra. You're like, oh my God, it's never coming. You could be doubting your intuition about what's actually changing in your union or in your love life, but they're coming. There's a new beginning here. You could be meeting new people, Okay, and there's nothing wrong with meeting new people, but don't count something out. Because I feel like you actually have a good masculine here. I feel like there's just a hating ass hoe on the sidelines that this masculine had to find out about. There's a family secret that came out about how somebody's jealous and envious and how they don't want to be seen a certain way. Somebody here lost this competition, this secret competition that they in. Like, bitch, what? <laughs> like, fuck. Somebody keep on trying to dig up shit on you to bring up about your past, but they got a whole skeleton full of shit. What the fuck else? So I feel like you still need to let love in, let other people, you know what I'm saying? Vibe with other people, blah, blah, blah. That doesn't mean that you have to be sexual with them or anything. They could just be cool. They could be friends, but don't stop letting love in. Share your love and light with other people and just know that this relationship here with whoever this is is coming in. Just period. Yeah, playfulness. I feel adventurous. 
Change me, divine beloved, into one who is wildly open to the new. Free me from rigid patterns that no longer serve. Let me feel adventurous and spontaneous, knowing that the more I open to life, the more it opens to me. Period. Yeah, unfolding. And intuition. So your intuition is telling you that something is unfolding, but you could be, you know, you're not too happy about what's going on or you don't know if it's coming. It is. But um, let's see what else. Decisions. Perfect actions are shown. Change me, divine beloved, into one who can offer all decisions to you. May I trust during times of transition that the perfect actions will be shown. Grant me patience to allow events to line up as they need to. Yeah, so somebody is watching you online. Here could be a Sagittarius with this archer right there with bow and arrow or whatever. But um, this person is watching you online and they're like, oh, well, you know, you're making the right decisions. Yeah, you are. What the fuck? Somebody expects you to make the wrong ones. I'm like, what the fuck? What else? Oh, that's a lot, but I'm going to take them. Oh, it's only two. I thought it was a lot that flipped over. So it says, source, you are my source. Change me, divine beloved, into one who knows that you are my source. Fill me with confidence and faith so I know never to have to beg, just gratefully receive. And then we have trust. I trust the highest way. Change me, divine beloved, into one who wants what you want for me. Let me trust that my needs will always be met in the highest way when I allow you to guide me. Yeah. So right now, your trust and your faith needs to be strong. Challenge. Yeah, there's a challenge. Uncertainty. Soulmate. Yeah, you're uncertain about this soulmate. You're uncertain about this person. But I feel like Spirit has somebody specifically set up for you. I think I got that for uh, Cancer. Yeah. So you need to trust the journey. This is not going to be for everybody because some, some of y'all don't have people that you know. But even if you don't know this person yet, just trust that the right relationship is going to come. Don't settle. Settling would not be good for your highest good right now or at all just in life, period. <laughs> so this was your reading, Libra. I hope that this reading um, gave you some sort of clarity. Um, like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you won't miss my reads, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.